Happy 4th of July. Many events happening all over the tri-state today, including one of the biggest events all year long, red, white, and blue ash. People lining up early to get in. Many waiting hours outside the gates. The first of the thousands expected to attend today. The wait paid off for them with good weather and good fun. Nine on your side reporter Roseanne Aragon live at Red, White and Blue Ash right now with more on how organizers are handling security concerns in light of the FBI warning that U.S. cities could be targeted by terrorists this weekend. Roseanne? Julie, as you can see, there are thousands of people already here, more than 120,000 people expected to attend. But this year, for the first time, it's here at the new Blue Ash Summit Park, a park built with security in mind. On every Independence Day, Blue Ash native Marie Wilkins takes her family to see the fireworks. But this year's at the new Blue Ash Summit Park. Proud. I think we're all proud of what the city's doing and making it a better place to live. An event that's ever evolving. Double the amount of vendors, more than 120,000 people expected to attend. It's no doubt security is a top priority. Obviously, with us being one of the largest events in the tri state, we worked with the Cincinnati Bureau of the FBI. Um, and we're also working jointly with Hamilton County Sheriff's Department and obviously our fine officers in Blue Ash. So um, we're taking security measures that will um, keep us safe, but obviously you never know um, what can happen. So we're just taking all the precautions we can. More than 60 officers on foot. This coming after a growing concern of potential terror. But the people here say the main focus of today is much greater. Them terrorists ain't going to win. We don't see the security. We don't care. We're here to have a good time. We want to celebrate our freedom. And that's what this day is all about. And even though terrorism, you never know when it's going to strike or this, you know, security, um, things like that happen. Um, we don't want that to take away from our celebration. Many of these people waiting for the fireworks. And not to mention... The Doobie Brothers. <laughs> That's back in my day. <laughs> Again, fireworks will be tonight here at 10 o'clock. Security will be patrolling the area, and they urge anyone who sees anything suspicious or anything that just doesn't feel right to report it so that everyone here can have a fun and safe 4th of July. We're live tonight at Blue Ash. I'm Roseanne Aragon, 9 on your side.